Hello. I am continuing with my subject of Ra and the Jovian program. I think that since he replaced what he had told us and taught us and we organized, that it is very critical to understand that the human design system is self-teaching. He made the uh, introduction to us when we first met him that his big promotion was, I am just the messenger. And so um, I think that his early understanding was that the human design system would make him extremely rich just because people would buy his books and buy his tapes and so on. But I think that was a huge disappointment to him that it took so long. Now, during the time that we were his agents trying to um, figure out how to make that analyst training effective was the goal. And so when I said raw was kind of, uh, I mean, I use the word fraud, but I don't think that is the right word. I think con man or hustler, he was a hustler. He was all the time looking at what would sell, what would make money. And so I think that motivation was quite central to him. He, I, as far as I know, he was the recipient of the revelation of human design. So uh, all hats off to him for that. I totally appreciate the fact that that was a great service to bring that forth. I was quite disturbed with the uh, later Jovian archive emphasis on interpretation that was not what we got taught or tried to present originally at all. That whole thing with the types and profile strategy authority, all that stuff was Ra's. And I would say you should either pay him or not use it because the human design system is self-teaching. That means you can observe for yourself and with a bit of an introduction, you know, our book, Human Design Revealed, does point out the original revelation mechanics and from the mechanics, then, you can observe how it works, what a composite works like, how a transit affects you. You can figure out what the conditioning of somebody else might be. Anyway, because it is so self-teaching, I've had to completely eliminate all of Ra's interpretations because I couldn't get it. I listened to this guy, Ra. He was always great. How did you get that? What is this? And it really was my original motivation to... Uh, what Ra says, repeat after Ra, oh, he says this. And I would say that was very enticing because he was extremely gifted talking about human design. He was great. But after a bit, 
you would repeat the same thing. You'd look at a chart and you wouldn't know what you were talking about. And that was so disconcerting. And it happened all the time. It's like you could take every class, have every name, memorize everything, and you look at a chart and you don't know what you're seeing. And therefore, I developed that other system completely devoid of using anything from Ra. Zen is the word that refers to that meditation of staying in the present, just observing. And because I think this is very central to understanding how it works, I developed something that had no names Ra came up with because they didn't work easily or, you know, a little bit, but then you'd try using it and you would say something and you wouldn't feel that good. But because of that training, you figured out how to hide it and bluff your way till you could say something that was maybe more accurate. Ra originally was very motivated to convincing people that human design was for real. And his early motivation was that people understood that it was real because the science of neutrinos was going to be discovered <clears throat> Later in 1999, it was, or 80, 98. But he had quite a goal to convince somebody or anyone, everyone, that uh, what the revelation gave was something that he wouldn't have known. And therefore, this thing of the neutrino proof was very important to him. So, you know, when we did the teacher's training, all the teacher's training was, was the introduction lecture, back and forth, up and down the restaurant, in front of the windows, Raw would be doing the introduction lecture because he wanted us to be able to do it just like he did when the red car bangs into the white car little white paint gets on the red car and so his main goal was to uh, state that neutrinos were going to be discovered and the neutrinos were the proof of astrology, that because neutrinos have mass, that was the deal. Their mass then allowed them to be changed by banging into other things that had mass, like planets. And so that was the original... Uh, emphasis was let's make sure we understand he had this revelation